Hello friends, so today we can discuss this question from Unit code 1365 How many numbers are smaller than the current number? So it's an easy problem. The question statement states that you are given an array of nums and each number is an integer and uh, what we can say is you have to find out how many numbers in the array are smaller than it. So as you can see in this example for 8 all the numbers are smaller than it so answer is 4 for 1 no number is smaller than it so it's answer 0 for 2 like this is smaller than it so only 1 for 2 1 3 3 numbers are smaller as you can see the question is pretty clear so what I've done is I can see it from this example I've written down the same example from the question which I have told you earlier so I have made because the limit of this question are given to be like the value of nums can be from 1 to 100 so I have made two arrays of 100 but there can be different ways to do it but like this is the way I have done it so what I have just made the this is the index these are the indexes this one this the index so what we can do is uh, I have only write the solution for 10 because the maximum for this case is 8 so I have written out for 10 but for for larger numbers I have written out for 100 so what we can do is this is the indexes then we have made a frequency array for this so 1 this is only 1 so I have written 1 2 the occurrence of 2 is 2 3 for occurrence is 1 8 the occurrence is 1 and rest is a zero. Okay. Now this is a sort of prefix prefix sums, but a different type of prefix sum. No different, but how I have made it is like this. For zero, it's zero. For one, what we have done is because we have to see how many numbers before it are there, which are less than it. So no number is before it are less than it. So we have to write zero. For two, what we have seen is how many number are before it which are less than it as you can see one number is before it so this is the prefix sum and this is the number with which is before it so one so addition of these two numbers so like i have written this array as a in my like solution and this as b so what we have done is to write any index bi we have to made the addition of bi minus 1 and ai minus 1 so these two additions give the bi index and ai index is just the frequency array okay as you can see here 2 plus 1 4 is 3 plus 1 so what we are doing is actually this is the sum and this is the the number of occurrence of the latest number so the sum and the latest number give the previously how many occurrence are there so that's a simple logic I made two vectors and uh, this is the first the, the frequency array like making the frequency array and then as you have told you it is filling the prefix array like bi is bi minus 1 ai minus 1 and this is the solution array the final array and what we have to do is just for the ith value of ai we have to just find the bth value of ai the num psi so like for finding how many numbers are before 5 which are greater than so you have to see just 4 numbers there so that's only what I've done and you have to just return the answer I hope you understand this logic uh, if you have any doubts please mention it in the comment box and uh, I'll like answer them as quickly as possible thank you for watching this video and I'll see you in the next one